Hey, welcome back to my channel. I want to welcome my new subscribers. I have several of you and I'm so happy to have you here. Today I'm going to be doing a fall tablescape. It's going to be kind of a French farmhouse country look. These dish towels came from Ikea and they are the Ellie dish towels. They are $3.99 and they are such a good deal. It's like less than a dollar a piece for each. I'm also going to be using this really nice antique looking table runner from Amazon. I will be using these Ablaga dishes that have these beautiful scalloped edges. I just love them. As well as I think I'm going to try to add these Vardon goblets um, to the table also. I'll be using these placemats that I found at Target recently. And as well as these little napkin rings that I found in the Hearth and Hand home at Target as well. And lastly, I found some candlestick holders that were brass that were thrifted. I got those really cheap for about $6. I'll be using those also. But the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of set the backdrop. I bought this ladder recently and this wreath. Uh, the ladder came from Hobby Lobby and the wreath came from Target. I also made this little chenille blanket that I could drape over it. I really wanted... Um, a cabinet. I have one in mind, but it's not in stock right now. So I decided that the ladder would be a nice substitute and give the table kind of a nice backdrop. I'm just taking my Ray Dunn pitcher and I am putting some flowers from Hobby Lobby and Michaels into it. Next I'm going to show you how I laid out my place setting with my placemat, my dishes and towels from Ikea as well as the little napkin holder from Target. So I'm just going to show you real quick what I did. I just folded these dish towels in half because they are pretty large. And then I just gathered them together and uh, put the napkin ring around it, and that's all you do. I should probably mention that my table is from Ikea also, but I don't believe they sell this one anymore. Also, I wanted to use the yellows and the blues because I'm just really partial to those colors and I thought that they looked really good with this table. Now I'm going to take my candlestick holders and I just thought they would bring a little elegant touch to the table to have the candle light. I always think that looks so pretty. And here's how it looks so far. Next I'm going to take these various pumpkins that I have and a couple of the yellow apples that I purchased recently and I'm just going to put those in various spots throughout the table just as a filler.
table as it was, but I really wanted to add these goblets and see just how this display looks with the goblets. look to it that's really what I was going for here and I think I achieved it so what do you think do you like it with the goblets or without the goblets I didn't put any silverware down because I usually do that at the very end anyway when I'm, um, I'm setting a table comment if you have any um, comments or suggestions and subscribe if you would like to see more and I will see you in the next video.